Hey you, welcome back. Today we're going to be heading back into the city. We're just going to do a little bit of riding today. Today we got the T-Line and the Super Light. The Super Light I just finished building up and hopefully everything rides smooth. <laughs> Recently we switched out the bike computer to this Cat Eye Urban Wireless. Today will be the first time we're going to be using it. We want to see how fast we normally ride. Besides this, if anybody can recommend a good app or an app that they're using, please let us know. Let's go. All right, everyone, welcome back. We're doing another ride video today. We're going to head a little bit uh, to the east side and ride around there today. Check the weather yesterday it said it was going to be about uh, 60 degrees and it was supposed to be raining the whole day but when we woke up and checked the uh, weather that it uh, changed to fog so it's supposed to rain a little bit later on in the uh, afternoon but for the morning it's gonna be nice and uh, uh, dry all right I gotta speed up because uh, Choco's a little bit faster today. Yeah, like this. It's pointing up? Yeah. It's not easy taking these camera shots and I have to keep up pace with the T-line. In some shots you're going to notice her pulling away ahead and I try and do my best to uh, keep up with it. It should be around there. <laughs> Last week I adjusted the saddle and I don't have a torque wrench, so I guess I didn't tighten it enough. And the saddle uh, seems to be moving, so we gotta get that adjusted. And I didn't bring any tools because uh, on the super light, I've really never had any problems uh, that I would need to carry tools. But I guess since uh, the T line is new, I should bring some. That's comfortable now. Yeah, it's, you know, it's still loose though. So if you sit on the back of it, it might go up a little. So if you start to feel it becoming uncomfortable, uh, let me know and I'll adjust it. Shoko is used to riding the steel bike and switching to the T line. She has to adjust and learn how to control the speed and brakes. You gotta block it. That's one thing if you ride in the city and you're following a group of bikers, um, don't trust them. Always uh, check yourself and unless you're 100% sure you're safe to go, uh, don't go. That's a senior station. Oh, really? Where they used to put the Christmas tree. I guess they're taking down the lights now, right? <laughs>
going to notice in this video, Shoko is going to be further out ahead of me and I am going to be struggling to try and uh, keep up with her. Man, it's actually very nice out. Very nice. Right now we're heading towards uh, Central Park. We're at 54th West Street and we're gonna head to the east side of Graham and head to uh, Roosevelt Island. Let's go. Yeah, I was talking to the car. The guy was gonna hit me. He didn't even look. Yeah, then he started to go. So I, that's why I yelled at him. <laughs> oh no. Did you see he, uh, the poor guy who jumped? Yeah, the, the entrance to the bike lanes over here. Woo, smells good today. Oh yeah, they're, they're eating over here. Let's go through the park. I just put these uh, tennis tires on and I'm breaking them in. And I think I got water in the front uh, rim and I can hear it making a strange sound. I got to check it out, but hopefully it'll be all right. Yeah, we're gonna go right. What was that? No, no. We're gonna go right, but be careful. Come. It's too much PSI. Very easy to slip. Yeah, you know, it's not the tire PSI. It's just the way it's designed. Oh, bus is coming. <laughs>
Did you know that New York City has a tram? Let's go check it out. We gotta buy here. Oh, <laughs> be careful. Oh. there because I can't see anymore. Going down. <laughs> <laughs> we got the, across the river. Oh, it's nice and fast. Yeah. How much was it uh, one way? Three grand. I think oh, they two. raised. Now I want the talk. <laughs> <laughs> Tramway Plaza, Roosevelt Island. I guess we're starting over here, right? Yes. And then I guess we'll just head around this way. There's something to see. Oh, here. This okay. is a historical so Let's Let's building. head down and then up. That's what we do when we come to the city. We don't really have plans. We just like riding around. This island is small, but the bicycle is still the best way to get around. Please rent one if you don't have one. I smell the weed. Oh yeah. Cherry blossom. Already, I know. It's so quick. It's beautiful. Spring is coming. Makes me feel happy. Man, on the left you got uh, Queens and on the right you got Manhattan. Beautiful view. South Point park. Park rules. Does it say no bike? Uh, so only here, no bike. Oh, okay. So we can bike inside. Yeah, yeah. That's nice. I wanna go walk. Yeah, let's walk. Ah, this is cute. We're on the south side of Roosevelt Island and we're taking a quick break and to prepare for uh, the bike tour that's coming up we actually bought these uh, energy supplements. This is our first time trying them. If you guys have a recommended flavor or something you guys like please let us know. We've actually never used these before. Which one do you want? The uh, vanilla or the cola? I'd like to have vanilla. How about you? No, I want the banana. <laughs> Paper, rock, scissors, shoot! <laughs> <laughs> one, one more time, I didn't do the timing. Okay, one more time. Paper, rock, scissors, shoot! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Coke then. Alright, you know I, I actually do want the cola. Okay, yeah, then you have that I take one. a vanilla. This one says it has 40 milligrams of caffeine in it and uh, 100 calories. I don't know if that's good or not. That's 100 calories. Okay. Now how many uh, milligrams of caffeine in that one? 20. 20. So that's actually half. Look. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. Tastes gross. <laughs> <laughs> ah. It's not bad. It just tastes like kids, uh, you know, Coca-Cola candy. Are you supposed to eat the packet all in one go? There's a lot of syrup in it. She's still trying to process the vanilla bean flavor. Cat Sanctuary and Wildlife Rehabilitation Center. It's about 11.30 a.m. now and uh, we finished having those gel, energy gels. 
So we'll be good for another few hours, I hope. Uh, but we're gonna probably grab something to eat after this. <laughs> Smallpox Hospital. It's really got nice lines to it. It's very beautiful. Franklin D. Roosevelt, Four Freedoms Park. We're all the way at the south side and they have this memorial here. At the entrance to this place, there's a little booth with uh, someone making sure you don't bring your bikes in. We folded up the bikes. I tried to walk it in, but the lady said we can't uh, carry them either. So she was actually nice enough to let us place them inside her booth until we get back. Very nice so far. Yeah. Chrysler building. Rectangle shaped thing is United Nation. What's going on here? Yeah, this is very beautiful this part. place to relax before we left this morning I inflated the two bolito tubes on the t-line and over the course of about a week they lost about uh, 15 psi I think the caffeine from those gel things we had are making me want to go to the bathroom we're gonna try and head back towards the bridges and on the second bridge we're gonna head over to uh, the Brooklyn side Blackwell House has been placed on the National Register of Historic Places in 1972 by the United States Department of the Interior. Yeah. It does seem like a different place or a different town in a different state. We can, we don't have to walk here. Okay. Wow, this looks beautiful. It's so nice out today, we can't even wear the jackets. Right now we're gonna head over the bridge and we'll probably try and find a place to uh, have lunch. I guess we gotta take the elevator up and then we'll go down the bridge again. To get to this uh, bridge, we had to take the elevator to the fourth floor and now we just got to cross over and there's a bike lane on the uh, right side. There is a way to come up here on the ramp, but uh, some guy told us that it's a little bit more uh, difficult because it's very steep. You can save energy by using the elevator. Look everybody, 
it's see-through <laughs> oh my gosh if you're scared of heights i don't recommend it here oh wow left side you can see some food trucks and vending dolls riding around you can find so many wonderful places that you would never see so this is the end of this one please join us next time and like and subscribe